Hello, my name is Christian Walter from TradeVola, investing with know-how and transparency. Today we want to have a look here at the client portal of Glenda Active Broker because there are a lot of changes in the last uh, months and if you want to discuss anything about um, different brokers, Interactive Broker Trade Station or any topic related to investing, feel free to subscribe to our channel, leave a comment and we will be happy to um, discuss this in one of our next um, sessions. So the client portal, there's um, many things uh, what you can check. You can also trade here from the client portal and to give you a brief overview, you want to have now a look here on the screen. Yeah, in the client portal, I think um, most of the things are pretty simple and easy, like your portfolio, if you want to see your positions and um, your profit and loss, you can just go here to the portfolio. I think trade and research is also self-explaining. Um, transfer and pay, I think this is quite interesting. If you want to transfer positions, for example, from another broker, you can do this um, Yeah, as long as the product is also listed with Interactive Broker. Also here, you can send positions out to other brokers as well, also as an internal transfer between different IB accounts. Let's try the incoming and choose United States. We want to transfer some positions from a US broker. Um, most of them will work with ACATS, Automated Customer Account Transfer Service. So you just select this. And if you check here, choose broker, for example, you can go here to trade station securities. If you have an account there, put the account number and everything will be transferred to your interactive broker account. That's, um, I think, one important thing for the menu transfer and pay. Um, all the other settings with permissions and market data you will find here under this icon. If you go to settings, this I must say is a little bit hidden and not so easy to find at the beginning. Um, let's do it one more time. Change. And here you find everything related your, to your profile. You can um, change your password. You can um, add, like I said here, market data subscriptions. You can change your trading permissions under trading. Also, if you change your trading permission, some trading products or some financial products, they require um, yeah, higher income or higher liquid net worth. So you can also change this if needed in your finance profile, if um, this will be yeah, required in your um, yeah, financial profile. Also changed in the past for the trading commissions, for example. Um, yeah, the rest, I think, it's also pretty self-explaining um, performance and reports. You will find all information and also your text report, your yearly text report. You can just check it here under statements and then activity. And uh, from time to time, it's also important to check all your messages. If there are some change so that you don't agree to something, your market data can be um, canceled and um, sometimes also important information will be only sent here via the message service. So always keep an eye on it, what is important um, and uh, double check this uh, well as well. And if you want to learn something more about the Trader Workstation, for example, then you can also go to our website and um, see our Trader Workstation Masterclass and download the Trader, Master, uh, Trader Workstation um, playbook for free and um, everything else you find in the video below in the description. Yeah, I think this was quite interesting to see what is the potential of the client portal, what you can do and where you can find it because some of these things I think are quite hidden. So if you don't want to miss any of the upcoming videos or things about Interactive Broker or other brokers, please subscribe here to our channel. Leave a comment, we will be happy to welcome you here soon again. Thank you very much.